All right, y'all. Back for R.I.P. to Duck Flight and his girlfriend, man. Uh, I have been watching these videos the last couple of days, just not on here, but I figure why not? R.I.P. He must be doing some exposing. You feel me? Um, and I didn't watch Flight's video either. I guess I have to watch that after this. I guess he made a response video to the first video. Um. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and get into the video, man. Before we get it started, as always, smack that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel. Also, comment some more stuff that you guys want to see me react to. And let me know what you guys thought of the video, man. Link to Soul Illuminati's channel and to this video in particular will be in the description box down below if you guys want to go check those out. Let's get it. What's good with your young boys? Hey, man. All right, now check this out, man. For all my new subscribers, if y'all don't know what's going on, I made a video yesterday letting a certain YouTube, a certain YouTuber by the name of Dut Reacts, I let him know that his girlfriend, she was trying to fuck with. It's that simple. Now they basically responded to the video, they reacted to the video, and she gave her her opinion on everything, and basically. Trying to make it seem like that she wasn't trying to fuck with me. She was trying to give her explanation on what was going on, etc., etc. And at the end of the video, Flight reacts. I guess Flight just tired of all this bullshit. So he said he gonna finally play me 1v1. Now hold on. Check I don't know, man. I ain't never seen Saluminati play, but he so talked to talk. Flight but Flight talked to talk too before we seen him get out there on the court. I'm not gonna lie. I, I don't know what pain Flight is going through right now. Not only is he going through this shit for a female that's not even his girlfriend. Right. But now he have to play me 1v1. That's the last thing that Flight wanted to do. I feel bad. For, I know he at home right now just like, man, how am I going to get out of this situation? Now check this out. So I showed y'all yesterday that his girl wanted to fuck with me. I couldn't show y'all a lot of shit because she deleted all her messages. So basically, she wanted to. She if she deleted, to that make it look more sketchy to me, man. You know, she she deleted the messages. Like, look, that make it look so much more sketchy. I don't really talk about the shit. We already know. But look, I hope y'all can see this. Now this is the DMs. All y'all see is my DMs. Right. She deleted all of her messages, my nigga, all of them. So the only screenshot that I had was the screenshot that I took on Twitter. Because she told me that she was tired of everybody assuming that her and Flight was together. So I did her a favor. And I went on Twitter and I let everybody know that they not together. Simple. They not together. Y'all can stop saying that she free. Now, Ari. All you got to do. You making this shit so hard on Flight. All you had to do was say, okay, me and Flight not together. And I was trying to fuck with Solomonati. Is that simple? <laughs> you make this full video trying to make it seem like that you wasn't fucking with me. What happened to all the messages? Where is everything? Why you delete the man? Why you delete your messages? Yeah, that make it look worse. Deleting your messages on your side of it. I mean, you, like maybe there was something in that. See, it's cool. It's not that big of a deal. If you fucking with me, it's straight W's. You don't have to shy away. I didn't say, oh, Ari trying to. I ain't say. I know the title said Ari want the D. I know the title said that. But in the video, did I say, oh, Ari want to fuck? Or did I say, oh, Ari is a thot? Or Ari this or Ari that? I just said you wanted to fuck with me. Why are you making this so hard on yourself? I know this is too much pressure for you. And it's too much pressure for flight. Me, I'm just chilling. But I hate when females lie. And then you show, you show these messages. What happened to the rest of the conversation? Where did, all, where did the messages go? Now, Ari. I'm going to say this one more time. I made a post on Twitter asking for your Instagram. Right. A million niggas sent me your Instagram. Your name just was spam. They sent me your Instagram name. Right. I went on your Instagram. I seen your pictures. Boom. I left it at that. Did I hit you up? No. Out of respect for flight. I left. I'm not finna hit another nigga girl up, bro. It's a billion bitches in this world. I'm not finna try to fuck with another bitch of that's, that belong to another man. Especially if it's this YouTube shit. I'm not gonna do that. You feel me? I didn't hit you up. You, how did you, hold on, hold on. Ari, how did you find my Instagram?
How did you find my Instagram? You must have been looking. You you did your research and found my Instagram somehow. He got a point. I mean, hey. <laughs> you wanted my attention. You made it clear as day that flight was not your man. You was texting me paragraphs. A lot of shit that y'all didn't even get to see because she deleted it. But you was texting me paragraphs. We was having a good ass conversation. You telling me all about yourself. You don't want to fuck with me, right? You telling me all about yourself. Then you show everybody the messages of when we was conversating about flight. And I let you know. I let you know why flight didn't want to play me 1v1. And you was basically agreeing, well, he should do this and this. And then you told me some personal shit about flight, talking about he was going through a lot. And I wasn't about to tell all everybody his business. That's his personal business. I'm not about to tell him, oh, flight going through this and, and flight going through that. From far as me and my niggas know, flight didn't want to play me 1v1. Because I unfollowed him on Twitter. That's what he told that's me. That's kind of petty too to me, and man. But hey, everybody. people do what they want. But you told me the real. You said Flight was going through some stuff and he was in the middle of moving and this and that and that and this. That's his personal business. And I made it clear. And why would you tell him all that if you're not rocking with him? That you and, you and Flight are not together. You are strictly single. You made that perfectly crystal clear. You, you sent me a full paragraph. What did I say? After that, I said, well, this is not about flight no more. This is about me and you, right? Now, where did oh. the rest of the conversation go, Ari? And I'm not trying to expose you or nothing, but you made the video trying to make it seem like you wasn't trying to fuck with me. You trying to make it seem like me and you was just talking about flight. Where did Where is all the messages? Because I don't have them because you deleted them. I'm just, why did you delete them? All my messages are here. I mean, I ain't got shit to hide. I mean, what the fuck? This shit, True this enough. Shit is not, this shit is nothing, you know? But it's something to you because you're not used to this type of pressure. And I didn't even want to put this pressure on you. All you had to do was say, I want. I was conversating with Soluminati. We was talking. It was cool. And the only reason why we stopped talking after she was sending me paragraphs and paragraphs and we was having a nice little conversation is because who? Because I stopped responding. Now, if I would have kept that conversation... What y'all think, man? Y'all think uh, y'all think that she hiding something or y'all think that so Illuminati uh, bluffing? I'm the one that stopped talking to you. I, 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 I had to put you on pause for a few days, you know? I was doing a lot, club all on Snapchat. I was going through a lot. I was just living my life. You, on the other hand, I holler at you in, in a couple days. I get you had to get some type of treatment. But the fact that you making it seem like you wasn't trying to fuck with me, if you wasn't trying to fuck with me, why are you deleting messages? What is you trying to hide? You made your little video trying to show everybody what you want them to see. Where are all the messages at, baby? The bottom line is, her and Flight is not together. Flight said in a video that he doing, he, Flight basically giving her free clout. Why? All right. I don't know. But he basically giving her free clout. He said they've been knowing each other for a minute. They not together. But from what we see, Flight feels some type of way about this girl. Flight see, hold on, man. Sad in that video, and that's why I feel bad for him. I don't pause it usually, but guys, don't you guys think that's kind of weird? Because when Zeus and B. Lou did the little thing, the Smasher Pass thing, right, and they brought her up, why was he getting so mad? If she, if he didn't like have feelings for her. That's what I, I mean, I'm not taking no sides. I'm going to stay in the middle. But why was he taking sides if, uh, if, why was he, like, why was he getting so mad if he don't have feelings for her? That's all I got to say on that situation. All right, me and you know what's up. I mean, you looking real guilty. You deleting messages. You the one that slid in my DMs. You texting me paragraphs. You asking where I live at. This and that, that and this. I wish I had messages that I could show y'all, but they are all gone. She deleted all of them. When you delete messages on Instagram, when you delete the messages that you sent on Instagram, nobody longer can see them, even the person you sent them to. So if I send you a message right now, boom, and then I want to unsend that message, I can. And you you can't even see that I sent it to you type shit. So she, that's what happened with that. But anyway, so Flight basically said, man, I'm just tired of this situation. I think the only way I could get out of this situation if I play Solomonati 1v1. 
That is the last thing that Flight Reacts wanted to do. Flight, I feel so bad for you. <laughs> because you know we've been waiting for this 1v1 for quite some time. And that's the reason why I've been on your head so heavy. Now, I'm not trying to be a bully, but Flight is a trolling-ass YouTuber. Flight know that he is a doodle shirt in a 55 overall. And he still posts these videos because he know we going to react to it. He going to get all these viewers. He going to keep getting these checks when we react. I done gave Flight, and I know y'all like, well, Flight got a million subscribers. He way bigger than you. I didn't give Flight unlimited shout-outs on my channel. Y'all look at it like it's clout chasing. It's really giving him shout-outs. Do you know how many subscribers Flight got from me? From the 2K community in general? If you go to Flight channel, all you're going to see in the comments is niggas that subscribe to me. All y'all niggas is on this channel. All Flight fans is just roasting him. Flight is a walking L. He posts these L-ass videos of him getting dropped off. He put the, he put all this shit on himself. This is true. <laughs> but now you have to play me 1v1. And you I'm do take a lot of L's in the basketball videos. You have to play me 1v1. I'm not going to be hard on you. I'm not going to. I'm going to follow you on Twitter. Right after this video, I'm going to follow you on Twitter. And I want you to hit me up. I'm not going to make no more videos about you saying, oh, I'm waiting for the 1v1 saying this, saying that. I want you to be as comfortable as possible. This is not about Ari no more. This is about me and you. I want you to be as comfortable as possible because you gave everybody the word. If the video hit 30,000 likes, it's going to hit 30,000 likes. <laughs> all your fans want to see you play me and all my fans been waiting for this. We've been waiting, my nigga, for quite some time. I'm not going to be hard on you at all. I'm not going to make no more videos about you, no more flight videos about you. I'm not going to say nothing about the 1v1, nothing. I'm going to leave it all on you. I'm going to let you take as much time as you want for this 1v1, but it have to happen. And you can't come up with some sad excuse talking about, oh, I don't want to play you 1v1 because you won't follow me on Twitter. I promise you, I'm not going to I'm not gonna unfollow you. I'm going to keep that follow button. And I'm not going to never hit you up talking about when is this and when is that. You said two weeks. You gave us your word. You said two weeks. You said two weeks. What if Flight beat him? He talking all this and Flight beat him. Like I said, I never seen Illuminati play, but. I'll come to you this weekend. What if Flight beat him? Like in, a, like in an upset or something? That'll low key be hilarious, bro. Just like with the Christopher London situation. When me and him had the little fake foo foo YouTube beef, I told him, nigga, I'll be there this weekend. That's how I am. My nigga, I'm from Detroit. I know how I hoop. I'm not going to sugarcoat shit. I'm going to tell you how it is, my nigga. I, I'm a, I will come to you. It's, it's that simple. You ain't got to waste no money. Just send me the time and date. I'll grab some hotels, bring a few of my niggas. We're going to turn up in your city, and then I'm going to drop you off. It's crazy that you waited this entire time to play a 1v1. So the rest of this is about flight. Yeah, probably. Because so I'm not going to let you touch the ball. You could get first ball, but I got I got to expose you, man. I'm sorry. And I feel bad for you because you didn't want this to happen. But Arby put this on you, and she ain't even your girl. And she over here lying. I don't even look at Ari the same no more. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I was feeling some type of way about Ari, but now since you want to lie, and everybody know the truth, but rest in peace, Ari. Say goodbye. Y'all don't even talk, don't even let that girl do her. She getting way too much attention from me and too much clout already, and she ain't putting no work. Y'all know the rule. Y'all know my rules. But flight, it's a different story with them. Let flight do him. I'm going to keep y'all updated on me and this flight situation. The 1v1 got to happen now. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's all we got this video, Don't come man. Up with no side I'm going uh, to I'm gonna watch the end, though. I'm not going to skip it. Right now. Well, no, he, 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 he following oh. flight. Okay. Well, why he following flight? We just going to go ahead. Uh, yeah. Let me know what you guys think, man. I kind of think that, you know, why would you delete the messages if, if, you don't have anything to hide. And another thought was just, what if Flight upsets Illuminati? Like I said, i never seen Illuminati play, but I've seen Flight play. But yeah, that, that would be hilarious. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video, though, go ahead and smack that like button. And hit the subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel. Also, comment some more stuff you guys want to see me react to. Let me know what you guys thought of the video, man. Link to uh, his channel, so Illuminati's channel, and to the video in particular will be in the description box down below if you guys want to go check it out. And with that being said, man... Till next time, guys, it's been your boy Squints. We go.